Mary Barra, CEO. As far back as Mary could remember, she loved cars. Her cousin had a fiery red convertible, and at 10 years old, she knew she wanted one too. Lucky for her, she grew up in a car town. She lived near Detroit, nicknamed Motor City. Detroit was where cars were made in the United States. Her father worked at General Motors, or GM factory, and Mary followed in his footsteps. In addition to cars, she loved math and science. Her parents wisely encouraged her to keep studying what she liked. That's how she found engineering. It's the type of science that deals with designing and building things. A car, a bridge, a tunnel, a dam, and a stadium are all designed by engineers. Few girls studied engineering, but Mary did. While still in school, she got her first job at GM. She inspected cars on an assembly line. Later, the company paid for Mary to get a business degree. Over the years, she held jobs in many different departments at GM. She was clever and straightforward. She easily mastered new tasks and kept moving up. In 2014, she was named the CEO or Chief Executive Officer of GM. Mary was the first woman to head a major auto company, and she led GM through good times and tough times. As engineers, scientists, and inventors, we get to imagine what's next and then make it happen, Mary said. As CEO, she invested in cars that run on electricity instead of gas and even cars that could drive themselves. She learned everything about the company and the business so she could make the cars of the future. A quote by Mary is that, if you have a problem, you've got to solve it because that problem is going to get bigger in six months.